Bearing down some 22 suicides a day in our nation, a local man was singing through tragedy tonight to help veterans at a benefit concert. Not on your sides, Jake, Jake Ryle was at the concert tonight and has the story behind the music. Jake? Well, this is a concert with a purpose, and one of the singers is hoping his song, as well as his story, could impact veterans battling PTSD. I know our purpose and I know what we're doing and I know it's going to be incredibly loud. John Preston picks his guitar, hoping to spread a message. Dude, look around, you know, look around. There's so many people that depend on you and love you. He spent four years in combat, six months deployed in Iraq. Yeah, I was dealing with post-traumatic stress. I was drinking a blackout every night. He found a passion in singing and songwriting. Preston says he won't ever forget when his life changed. I get a phone call finding out that my brother had taken his own life. His brother, Mike, a Marine and police officer, committed suicide. It, it altered and changed everything that was to let's make this as loud as possible. There is no stage but the top of the, the top of the world. Today, his stage is the fifth annual Oakwood Pavilion Family Fest, an event in honor of his brother and supporting 22 until Valhalla in the barracks projects, two local nonprofit organizations aimed at returning veterans to civilian life. The more that we raise just means the more people are going to be able to help. So, you know, there's really no value to saving. Even if we help one veteran tonight, even just by talking with them, how do you put a price on that? On stage, Preston sings a simple song, Superman Falls. My goal with that song was to show the entire world the mess that's left behind. Yeah, hey, I'm living in it. You know, I wake up every day as a little brother that doesn't have his older brother anymore. He's hopeful his song will carry a tune to veterans in need of help. It's what we do. You know, it, okay, yes, I'm a combat veteran, it, but it's not what I did back then that defines me. It's what I do moving forward. And we're going to be posting all of the information you needed to know on our website, WCPO.com, about those two nonprofit organizations that are benefiting from this concert. For now, reporting in Walton, Jake Ryle, 9 on your side.